Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about operations with complex numbers, and we're going to simplify. So, if I was given this, 7 minus 6i times negative 8 plus 3i, okay? Well, what I want to do is I want to multiply all parts of my first parenthesis times all parts of my second parenthesis. You might know this as FOIL. 7 times a negative 8 is a negative 56. 7 times a 3i is a positive 21i. Now let's do it with a minus 6i. Minus 6i times a minus 8 is a positive 48i. And a minus 6i times a 3i is a minus 18i squared. So now let's go simplify a little bit. Negative 56 comes down, but 21i plus 48i comes out to be a 69i. And then we subtract now 18 times, well, i squared we know is a negative 1. So this is where it's different than a normal variable in a sense. Um, i squared becomes a negative 1. So let's simplify that a little bit. Um, that subtracting uh, 18 uh, times a negative 1 is like adding a positive 18. So we have negative 56 here plus 69i plus 18. So now we want to combine the negative 56 and positive 18, and that comes out to be a negative uh, 38. So we have a negative 38 right there, plus 69i. And there we go. Our final answer here is just a negative 38 plus 69i. So let's recap. We're given 7 minus 6i times negative 8 plus 3i. We distribute uh, 7 times negative 8 to get a negative 56, and 7 times a 3i to get a positive 21i. Negative 6i times a negative 8 was a positive 48i, and negative 6i times a positive 3i was a negative uh, 18i squared. i squared becomes a negative 1, and 21i plus 48i became a 69i. That minus 18 times negative 1 is the same thing as a positive 18 right here. Negative and negative go positive. So a positive 18. We combine that positive 18 with a negative 56 to get a negative 38. So our final answer here is just negative 38 plus 